So we provide two different ways for uh, writing an action to your ring. The We call them actions because they're essentially what's going to happen when you hold your uh, ring up, your public part of your ring to, or your private part, to uh, somebody else's phone or, or you know another device that can talk the same language. Um, you can do it on the, so this is the first way, you can do it in your web browser. Um, if you hit up nfcring.com slash app, um, then you'll see you'll get this, what do you want your NFC ring to do? Uh, I'm going to ask mine to just hit up clear.co.uk, right? So when I hold my ring, um, it's going to take me to my clear.co.uk. So the first thing that I need to do is, uh, I've, obviously I've got to install the app on my mobile phone. I've done that already. Um, you'll see here we go. It's going to bring it up. What do I want to do? I'm going to say, well, I need to scan a QR code from a computer. Let's say I'm going to bring up a barcode scanner. And I'm just going to point the barcode scanner at the QR code. It's really quick. It's going to scan the QR code. It's going to say, uh, hold my ring to the back of my device. So we just do the usual, you know, hold it up. Take a couple of seconds. There we go. It's then going to say, woohoo, your ring is ready. Okay, so that's that written. Now let's test it. So if I hold my ring up to the back of this phone, it should take me to mcclear.co.uk. So let's give it a second. There we go. It seems to be open in the web browser. And it appears to be taking me to mcclear.co.uk. So, so that seems all good. That's the first method. So, huzzah, <laughs> network error. Um, okay, so the next approach, uh, so approach number two is using a mobile phone. Now, to use a mobile phone, we have to have obviously the app installed. We load up the NFC Ring app. And what we'll do is we'll select the first option. And the first option is create new ring action. So you do this if you're out on the go, or if you, you know, if you, you just wanted to quickly change it, maybe do some experiment. And um, I'm going to select Twitter from from the list. It's going to ask me to type in my Twitter username, which is John McClear. And I'm going to hit Next. And it's going to ask me to hold the ring up to the phone. I'm going to do that now. So holding it up. Okay. It's going to say, "Woohoo! Your ring is ready." going to hit finish and then exit so now we need to just test this ring make sure that it's written my Twitter URL and there you'll see that we've got the uh, Twitter page loading up and that's all seems to be working fine okay so that's the two different ways that you can write your uh, actions to your NFC ring Hopefully we'll have more ways in the future, but I think that we've got the two main ones covered where you can do it either through your web browser or through the mobile app. Have fun.